Hey guys, what's up? It's Senpai. I don't <laughs> It's just so ridiculous. I, I I don't even know how to start. Let's take it back a few years ago. My freshman year of high school. I'm a doe-eyed, ignorant, innocent little 15-year-old and a man comes in, asks me out and I say yes. And so we start dating. <laughs> And I will remember one day I was sitting on the floor in the hallway with him. We were hanging out with a bunch of our friends. He has some cookies. And no, this is not going where you think it's going. So he's passing out these cookies and I see them and I'm like, oh, can I have one? Is it cool? Like, uh, can I have a cookie? And I go and start to reach for him and he just goes, no! And he smacks my hand and I was like, dude, what the hell? And he just goes, there's blood in the cookies. What? I guess, I almost did like a double take in my head, like what? What the heck is going on? And so I was like, why do you have blood in your cooked in your cookies, dude. So he goes on to tell me that he is a vampire along with his friend who made the blood cookies for him. The vampire stories continued. I think there was um, a day where, you know, he he got a cut on his hand or something and I kissed it to make it better, you know, like couple stuff. And then I got a cut on my hand, and he kissed it, and then he was like, oh, We've exchanged blood. You're going to be turning soon. And I was like, what the f- If what he says is true, I'm technically a vampire right now. But, I don't know. I, I gotta say, I'm not really feeling vampirism very much right now, so that's kind of my vampire story. I dated a vampire. I can say that's on my list of ex-boyfriends. Oh my gosh, but bless his heart. I just... Oh, what a guy. What a guy. So, anyway guys, thanks for watching. So... <laughs> Alright, bye. <laughs> Subscribe!